Windy through Wednesday with the rainfall picking up in intensity as we head into the afternoon. You'll see well to the north associated with this low, the snow on the northern fringe. Now, as we continue across southern Ontario through central sections, so all the way up to what to water around the Sudbury area, we've got that rain that continues to fill through heavy at times as we head into this afternoon. And that extends all the way down from the east side of Georgian Bay, Barry coming down to Toronto, the Niagara region. And you'll see continuing east as well so anyone traveling through the afternoon evening pushing along the 401 corridor into eastern Ontario you're driving with that heavy rain for you now continuing into the evening we start to see some cooler air filtering back into the region so now cottage country switching over to that wet snowfall for us higher terrain areas just outside of the Toronto region picking up on some of that wet snow through the overnight and into Thursday morning now, we start to get that widespread wet snow across the area, inching down around the 407-401 corridor across the Toronto region. Heading through the afternoon, cool conditions for us and that wet snow mix extending across the western end of Lake Ontario through the day on Thursday. So in terms of the rainfall, the accumulations are significant, 20 to 40 millimeters still to come across the Toronto area, extending up around the eastern sides of Georgian Bay into parts of eastern Ontario along the 401 corridor we're in that range of 30 to 50 millimeters of rainfall so still some heavy totals there in terms of the snowfall although there'll be a couple of centimeters falling across the Toronto area the 401 corridor not expecting any accumulations there you could accumulate though over higher terrain northwest of Toronto about 5 to 15 centimeters and certainly perhaps up to 25 centimeters through parts of cottage country